Hey sweeties, Jazzy here, and welcome back to Let's Get Jazzy after two, three, four weeks, a month, a long friggin' time. I am back. Kind of. Well, I'm back. I want to say I'm back, but like before I, I'm gonna, before I get into the video, you already know what it's about, but like I'm just gonna give you like a little update. I am so sorry I haven't been uploading school. You know, you know the deal. I, I've talked about it in previous videos, but I'm trying to get back into it. I've promised myself instead of promising you guys that I'm gonna get back into uploading because every time I promise, I end up breaking my promise. I'm gonna say I'm gonna try very, very hard to start update uploading again and start uploading consistently if you guys want updates on that instead of just going to my my channel and seeing every day if i've uploaded or not i usually update stuff on my twitter so if you guys want to follow me on twitter i will tell you if i'm uploading if youtube's being stupid all that stuff so you can just follow and we'll see where that goes i will leave that link down there now I am going to talk about the whole point of this video because I talk too much. Alright, here we go, here we go. Forget my voice cracking. I am going to Fan Expo! Ah, I'm so excited! I have tickets! I have tickets. I'm going with Kieran and we're going to have a good old time. We're going to do a couple costume because why not? Least we can do. My dog is like attacking something <laughs> I am going to be costumes and I'm going to talk about those later on but for now I'm going to talk about the guests because there are a lot of guests coming if you guys want more updates on that you can let me know in the comments as well while you're down talking about things to do in Canada and tell me if you guys want to see me updating you on the guests that are going to be there every few weeks I'm going to try and do that if that's what you guys want and yes so now we're gonna get into it because it's been two minutes here we go first person who's kind of the headliner for the whole thing is actually stanley this is going to be his very last overseas trip because he said himself he's getting a little too old he can't do it and his last time is going to be in fan expo he's still going to expos though and conventions because he's stanley and why not but i know he's gonna to go to kamikaze and stuff still just overseas not anymore I hope to meet him, and I hope to breathe his air, and I hope he breathes some of his creativity into, into me, so maybe I can write the book that I've been writing for 10 years and finish it. That'd be nice. But yes, I want to get him to sign something. I kind of want to fist bump him, kind of want to give him a hug, kind of want to be Excelsior and Excelsior together, but uh, we'll see how that happens. As long as I get the signature, I will be happy with that. He's going to be there, and Christopher Lloyd's going to be there, a um, couple other people, Daredevil, if you guys have seen that Netflix show, the guy who plays Daredevil's going to be there, Punisher's going to be there, and some blonde guy's going to be there. I have not seen the show, so it could be the villain, and I just have no idea, but I know one of them's name is John Bernthal. I know that. So I'm going to watch it, and now I really have to watch it before I get to Fan Expo, next that I'm going to talk about is John Berriman's gonna be there real quick real quick story about John Berriman besides that I love him I almost met him though I kind of met him in kamikaze a couple years ago story time so I was I'm a genius I was before I got into Doctor Who and Torchwood and I just was kind of like eh, I don't know who John Berriman is and apparently according to my friend there was a guy and I thought he was a jerk because I was like, why are you telling me to move? Why are you telling me to move? Do you need all this space? Because I had no idea who he was. And um, he was like, can you move over so we can... Well, okay, he didn't say it. Some of his douchey security guards said it and he was just kind of there and he just kind of looked and smiled and like waved because Christine, Christine was freaking out for some reason. I don't know why. I was like, okay. So we leave uh, after I get into Doctor Who and after <laughs> I get into Torchwood talk to her about it and turns out that was John Berman and he waved and he smiled at me and I was just like and I was just seething because I was like how dare you tell me to move how dare your security guards you're not all that yeah he is he is all that and more and he's gonna be there I'm sorry John if I ever meet you again I'm gonna give you a hug or cry or but yes, so he's going to be there, and speaking of the little universe of Doctor Who and Torchwood, the three people that are going to be there are Alex Kingston, and you know how much I love me some Alex Kingston, 
Billy Piper's gonna be there, and also Freema. I can't think of her name, Freema, and I am so sorry, but she was Martha in Doctor Who. I love every single one of them. You guys know that I have a special place in my heart for Alex Kingston. She is my goddess. I want to meet her, and I want her to sign something and be like, hello, sweetie, with her name, and I'm gonna get a tattooed on my body somewhere in the vicinity, because yes, it's Alex Kingston, that's why. So hopefully I get to meet her and get like a photo with her. I'm not, I'm not going to talk about my cosplay, but obviously I'm going to be her song for one of them. So I kind of gave it away a little bit. So they're going to be there. Christopher Lloyd's going to be there. And a couple other people, some actors. Red from Orange is the New Black is going to be there. And there's going to be more announcements as the weeks go on. Oh, Jason Mewes and Kevin Smith are going to be there, and they're going to do Jason Mewes and, um, and Kevin Smith get older, or is it Jay and Silent Bob get old? It's their little comedy thing. Jason Mewes, Pelvic Thrust, they talk about sex for an hour. My kind of party. But yes, yeah, so I don't have tickets for that. I can't afford it, but I would love to go. That would be so great, but it's like $60 to go, and I just can't do it. So I'll just live vicariously through the people who are actually going to go. And hopefully we'll get a photo with both of them because yay. So yes, they're going to go. And now this video has been six minutes and I'm still talking. So real quick, I'll just talk about my cosplays. As you guys already know, I'm going to be River Song from the Christmas episode. And I'm also going to be Black Widow because Stan Lee. And then I'm going to be Copycat because Kieran is going to be Deadpool. So we're going to do a couple costumes I'm excited about. Um... River Song, I have a video coming up within the next few weeks for DIY, like, costume outfits, so that'll be a few weeks or months from now. I have six months, and I'm going to do, like, some creative cosplay things and post it on here for you guys to see, and I'm really pumped for that. I, so much more stuff on this channel, and if I change locations, I'll be so happy because this location is starting to stress me out because it's the same thing. It's just me sitting in front of you guys, and I don't like it. So hopefully I'll do more, and thank you guys for sticking with me for so long. As for the cosplays, those are what I'm going to be, and I'm going to try and fit my fat behind in the Black Widow costume because... I have a really big butt and it's going to be a problem. But I have six months. It'll it'll fit. It'll fit. I'll fit. I'll be fine. But yes, so that's going to be cool. And before you guys start yelling at me in the comments, I am going to be the Black Widow from the Avengers movie. Now, no, 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 no. Put comment. Stop it. Stop it. I actually know of Black Widow. I just like the Avengers movie better than I like the comic book version of her costume. Trust me, I know a couple fangirls, and we'll see names, and it's not all of them. Some of them who kind of, sort of, only know Black Widow from Avengers movie, which is fine. But I actually have read the comic books, and I know who she is, and I know her personality, and yes. So there we go. That's what's happening. Not going to rant into that, because then this video will be way too friggin' long. That's it. Thank you guys for staying with me. But unfortunately, that is all for this video. But we will always have the next one. See you later.